about driving a little reckless around yeah, here. Crazy in my day. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm sure we'll manage. He's a very good driver, so I really trust his skills. So it's about two and a half. No. Yeah. Two, two and a half. Yeah, two and a half exactly. Actually, we have our uh, navigation on two and a half hours to get to Monteverde. Yesterday we got here and it was a little chilly, but today the weather is insanely beautiful. 30 degrees weather. Lovely and sunny, but happy to be here right now. You? Uh, me also. I love this weather. I Our fun, uh, longer trip. Yeah. Longer trip, a broad trip together. Uh, obviously, it's not so easy during these times, but yeah, uh, they're handling virus really well, Costa Rica. And after yeah. like a year, all like over a year of restrictions, to finally not have to deal with that just feels so freeing. I've forgotten how much I used to enjoy life and like all the fun I used to have and now I have it back it's so so nice We can't find our accommodation, but the booking address for our accommodation seems to be wrong, which is slightly odd considering we should be at the right address. I don't quite know what's going on, but I'm sure we'll be able to figure it out soon enough. Here it's much cooler than down in San Jose. I'm a little chilly in my place, but I'm currently I have to wait here because we left the car here. This is our second accommodation. It's a bungalow. We have a whole bungalow to ourselves. We were supposed to stay here for five nights, but because of the unexpected delay, unexpected stay near the airport, we are staying here for four nights. But look at this place. We have a ranch. It's a ranch with horses and horses and cows everywhere. I will show you the other place. But yeah, here. It's very rural, up in the mountains, so it's cooler here, but let me show you this bungalow. Honestly, I'm so impressed. It's the cutest place. It feels very rural. Hello. Hello. Who Hello. Are Who are you? Um, I'm living here. Who are you? I'm living here too. Uh, nope. <laughs> yes. Uh, okay, I think you should go. Bye. I think you should go. No. Thank you, you're there. <laughs> Mm -mm. Okay, mm. Class, come. <laughs> this is how it looks. We have two bedrooms, this massive living room. Matt is loving life right now. <laughs> how nice is this apartment though? It's yeah, very, it's, it's, it's vintage and it's old school, but I kind I of know, like it. And we have TV, we have everything. This bedroom, one double bedroom with this view. I love this view. It's feels like a safari or a ranch I feel like this is a safari I, I can just imagine myself sleeping here tonight and then waking up to this wonderful view of the ranch and the fact we have cows and horses everywhere is just the sweetest I will show you more of the surrounding area later but standing as that's our car our rental car and that's the view from our seafood door it is beautiful. Look at this ranch. If you want to get away from very industrial life, this is the sort of place which would be perfect to just chill out and zen. Dining area. Nice high ceilings. We have a second bedroom here. Once again, big bed. But the view here is not as nice personally I think but it's nice that we get a nice variety of things and it's not bad it's actually quite cute also so it's the second bedroom that's our kitchen area fridge microwave stove and pretty much everything we need kettle toaster even blender everything oh my god it's so windy outside I don't know if you guys can hear that 
microwave. And that's the bathroom. Sink, toilet, and a shower. Look what I got from Matt. Little cutie. <laughs> So sweet. Thank you. Flower. Mm. We are looking for the Pikers Bridge, famous uh, Montevideo Day attraction. So he figures it this way. Let's see if he's right. We are back home now, it started to get dark, so we decided to do some food shopping for the next few days and then head back. And it's getting really cold here in Monteverde, my god. I mean, walking back, we were pretty cold to begin with. Matt gave me his hoodie and I had to wear long trousers, but now in this accommodations also freezing cold. I mean, I loved this place initially when we came here, but now I'm not so sure about it. It's cold. Also, we don't have hot water. I have no idea how to take a shower because I'm freezing cold. I'm literally shaking. I've put as many layers on as I could. And still shaking and we have no hot water. So I have no idea how this is gonna go. Wish me luck. Um, yeah, I don't want to complain too much, but I hate being cold and I'm so cold. Also, we have spiders and bugs everywhere here, and they're pretty, pretty big. Um, yeah. Matt doesn't like spiders. Um, neither do I, to be fair, like, at least I don't mind them. I know some people are really mm, scared of them. I don't mind them too much, but the fact that they're pretty big and they could end up in my bed, freaks me out a little bit, not gonna lie, and all these mm, relatively big black bugs also walk around here. Mm, and also this place is pretty loud because it's windy and when it's windy outside you can really hear the wind like um, hit the roof. I found a lot of flaws in this place, hence why probably the price is cheaper. Mm, but yeah guys, I think I'm going to end this vlog today. I'm sure tomorrow we'll do a lot more things. So stay tuned for tomorrow. Subscribe to me if you haven't already. And I'll see you in tomorrow's vlog. Good night. <laughs>